Welcome to the SRO training video series. SRO supports the educational research and outreach missions of Texas State University. First, we will demonstrate how to unload the shuttle from the chamber. At the end of each SEM session, users are required to reload the empty shuttle into the microscope chamber. This ensures that the shuttle is protected and is stored in a contamination-free environment when not in use. The FEI SEM is equipped with a load lock, which allows users to load and unload their samples without venting and pumping the entire microscope chamber. This feature helps minimize contamination in the chamber while providing faster loading and unloading. After logging into your account on the SEM user interface, press the navigation tab as shown. Toward the bottom of the menu, click the Unload button. This will start the process of removing the shuttle. During the process, the load lock will be pumped down to match the pressure inside the chamber. Once achieved, a gate valve will open between the load lock and chamber, allowing an arm to enter the chamber and remove the shuttle. The microscope stage will rise in order for the transfer to take place. During this process, you will notice the vacuum icon changes color during this time. This is normal. Once the shuttle is engaged with the arm, the arm is retracted and the shuttle enters the load lock. The gate valve is then shut and the load lock is vented to atmosphere. This whole process takes a few minutes to complete, so please be patient. A status bar in the navigation menu indicates when the process is complete. After the load lock is vented, lift open the door and press the Release Load button located on the side of the load lock. This will release the clamps holding the shuttle in place. Before you handle the shuttle, make sure you are wearing gloves. Carefully remove the shuttle and shut the door to minimize dust and contaminants from entering the load lock. Now you are ready to attach your sample to the shuttle. When the shuttle is ready to load into the SEM, return to the load lock. Notice that the bottom of the shuttle has three red sensors. These sensors are fragile, so please be very careful handling the shuttle. The clamping assembly has three grooves that correspond to the location of the three sensors. Carefully place the shuttle on the assembly so that the three sensors fit into the three grooves. You can check to make sure that the shuttle is properly aligned if the clamp load button on the load lock is illuminated. If so, press the clamp load button to clamp the shuttle. Now, close the door and press the clamp load button once again to load the shuttle into the chamber. You can also load the shuttle by pressing the load button in the navigation menu on the user interface. The process now goes in reverse to pump down the load lock, open the gate valve, and load the shuttle inside the chamber. Again, this process takes a few minutes to complete. You can monitor progress by the status bar at the bottom of the navigation menu and by viewing the process via the chamber camera in the bottom right quadrant of the UI.